What's going on guys, Coach Malik here, and welcome to another episode of Malik's Fit Tips. We are gonna go over a great protein that's under 100 calories, has 20 grams of protein, and when should you eat, for your workout or after your workout? In this video, that's the two questions I'm gonna answer. What's going on guys, Malik. welcome Malik. to the Coach Malik, Malik Show. Malik. My name is Malik Benin, and uh, I am going to be your virtual coach. I'm gonna give you the knowledge, the tips, and the advice to help you perform better in all aspects of your life. Now, the first question on this video again, if you're watching on replay, type in the comments down below, replay, so I know who's coming back, and ask your question so I can answer it next video. But in this video, I answer Jason's question, and he asks, can you find a whey protein with zero added carbs, zero added flavor, and still have over 20 grams protein, staying under 100 calories per serving? I found a few close, uh, my top being brand called 100% grass fed, but interested in others. So, Jason, I did find a protein and I was looking and it's hard to find a protein out there that is 20 grams of protein, you know, very little carbs or any, and it being um, under 90 calories and flavor. This is the protein that I found for you, Jason XS. Uh, these actually come in pods, so it's pretty cool. I, uh, just found these but you pretty much pop one of these in your in your protein shake and then you shake it all up it's like a tide pod but it's a protein pod like a tide pod but a protein pod xx i will uh, if i can i'll leave a link down at the bottom so you guys can get this i don't get any money off of it but it has i'll read the nutrition facts right now 90 calories per serving so per pod 90 calories that's under 100 jason zero grams of fat one gram of carb, so you do got one, but it's uh, there's no added sugars. Uh, 20 grams of protein, and then 100 milligrams of sodium, 120 milligrams of calcium, 110 milligrams of potassium. Ingredients, whey protein isolate, sunflower uh, lechin, natural flavors, salt, don't really know how to pronounce this, but I think it's xanthan, X-A-N-T-H-A-N gum, which gives it that little like thickness. Stevia leaf extract, a little sweet for the vanilla um, and some other stuff. But that's pretty much mainly the ingredients. But right here, I highly recommend it. Quick dissolves, throw that pod, your drink, shake it all up. The pods are about the size of like an AirPod holder. So that's kind of from Carlos. Was wondering if you guys had any personal preferences between eating a meal before you work out or after. I usually work out at night after I get home from work. So I usually eat then, lift, because I try not to eat too late for dinner. But I feel like I may be more beneficial for muscle growth to feed them after the workout. Just curious on thoughts. Great question, Carlos. This is a wonderful question. This question, it differs totally between people. It sounds like you work out after work. So in my opinion, I'm sure you hear this all the time, don't eat after eight or don't eat late. In your situation, I don't agree with that because of two things. One, like you said, you feel like you'd be more beneficial if you ate after your workout. Now, I don't know what time this is, Carlos, but after your workout, you should be always be eating some sort of protein to rebuild the muscle you just broke down. I find it very high, higher risk of like injury when you're not eating or fueling those muscles because they're not gonna prepare properly uh, for your next workout when you use those muscle groups. So if you hit chest today and you don't recover it properly, the next time you hit chest, you're not gonna have optimal performance. So that's what I recommend is definitely eat something after your workout, Carlos. And if it is too late and you don't wanna put on too many calories in that meal, just have a high, a high protein meal. So lean meats, chicken breast, fish, you know, shrimp, something like that, it's light. You can still get your protein in. Maybe just a protein shake, you know, get that in before you go to sleep. But something uh, after your workout to help rebuild the muscle that you just broke down. Now, if you're trying to, you know, because I see that you're eating before because you don't want to eat after. If you do decide to eat before because you just worked a lot, right? You need some food, some energy for your workout. Try not to have as much. So as because you're having some afterwards, I have a little bit less and try to have your carbs beforehand and then your protein after. That's how I would do it, Carlos, is have your carbs before your workout just a little bit. Get that energy for the workout and then have your protein post-workout so you can have that recovery um, after you're done. Now, there's a similar question that Cassidy asked. It does, uh, so Carlos asked, should I eat before or after? Cassidy asks, I work, here's a new routine question. 
I work afternoons, so I'm loving the empty gym in the morning. But question is, what do you eat? I've always worked out at lunch or after work, so just wondering uh, how, how everyone eats or doesn't eat before hitting the gym first thing in the morning. Basically, Cassidy asked, should you eat if you work out early in the morning? Should you eat something, let's say you work out at 6 a.m., should you eat something before the workout? Well, Cassidy, are you hungry? That's why I, I would recommend if you're hungry in the morning and you can't seem to get a good workout without food, then eat something. Something that's great in the mornings are smoothies, uh, oatmeal, it's quick. Um, some people do get bloated off oatmeal though if they eat it too early because there's a lot of carbs there. So maybe uh, a fruit, a banana, an apple, right? Fruits are huge in the morning. People love eating fruits in the morning. One, you don't have to. If you're not hungry, you don't have to eat. Maybe drink a little water beforehand. I personally am not a huge fan of eating before my workout if I'm working out before seven in the morning. I just don't like, I like to stay uh, light. I will take my pre-workout. And sometimes if I need something, I'll have like a bite of an, uh, a banana or I'll have like a little bit of something, but I won't have like a full meal. If you are hungry and you do need that energy, grab a snack. Grab a banana, grab a piece of fruit, so it gives you that sugar, that natural sugar, that natural energy for the workout. And then if you are hungry and you want something a little quicker but more filling, oatmeal's great. Overnight oats too, if you even wanna make it quicker, you make your oats at night, put it in the fridge, already ready in the morning. And then like a protein smoothie is another option for you, Cassidy. Something quick in the morning, it's not too filling, you just drink it and go to your workout. But that's what I recommend, oatmeal or a protein shake, or a piece of fruit before your workout if you're working out in the morning. So that's today's tips, guys. That's today's tips on Malik's Fit Tips. Number one, is there any protein that's low calorie, high protein? Right here, excess uh, and quick dissolving pod. Leave, I'll leave a link at the bottom. Again, I don't get paid for it, but it's something I recommend. Try it out, let me know how you like it. And then the second question, should I eat before or after my workout? I would say eat before, a little bit of carbs, especially if you're working out at night, and then after your workout, try to have some protein in there so you can recover the muscle. Hopefully you guys got something out of that video. And if you did, or you want me to answer your question next video, comment down and then also comment down, replay, finish. Replay, finish, if you lasted this long in the video. Give it a like, share it if you found value from it. It can give you some value to your friends. Again, guys, remember, be certain in your skills, be certain in yourself, and be consistent in your actions because consistency is key. See you guys next video.